It's um, so I'm a f fairly new to Data Vault in general, and it's fairly obvious that how Data Vault helps with ingestion, but how does it help when it comes to uh, develop a star schema or some other modeling? Um, uh, yeah, modeling that the, the business can take advantage of, right? How do we get from these neat ingestion models like you know hubs? satellites, all that stuff, how do we get it usable to the business? Um, I think one of the main keys um, in in getting data, if you will, uh, developing, a, uh, if you want to say a star schema for a consumption at the consumption layer uh, is virtualization. Uh, we're able to construct views that simulate both dimensions and facts, for example, that remain views or virtual objects. Uh, this enables agility and flexibility at the consumption layer. It's much easier to be agile, to pivot uh, when you are working with a view rather than actually physically having to move data. And so, um, you know, that I would say that that is probably one of the key things is what we call virtualization, which is really, you know, writing a view uh, on top of a, a raw vault or a business vault. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And I, th I think that's the, as the key is, in, is understanding that's like you say, is being able to get it to the hands of people to review, because if, if you, let's say you're off the mark just a little bit, you can, you can turn around changes much quicker and then, then decide at some point in time, if it's getting to be where, you know, performance dictates that you have to kind of go to a physical table, then, then do so. But the agility play with virtualization, I think, is is definitely is huge. 